What's good, future millionaires? I'm December DeMarco, Fortune 500 marketer, bringing my professional experience to the new markets. Right now, we focused on crypto. This one just came across my pool coin charts, but y'all know we'll be talking about NFTs this week. I've been doing a major deep dive into a lot of these NFT projects to be able to bring y'all some of the freshest things. Also, I've been getting a lot of requests from the community over certain projects. And if you drop the project, know that I will be doing a video to cover it. So just stay tuned for that. I'll be dropping some of those videos today. But uh, make sure if you're new to the channel, you subscribe, turn on notifications. Make sure you follow me on Twitter at December DeMarco. Share this video and tag me for a chance to win a free gift. We are on our road to 20,000 subs. So we're going to be bringing a lot of new um uh, exciting things to the channel my student is flying in this next week to come do an interview to you know explain some of his investing journey you know we got a lot of new things coming also for y'all that don't know i am based in las vegas and i will be hosting a lot of i'm telling these parties will be exclusive but they'll be very lit and um basically i'm gonna call them the crypto parties I think that's the name we're going to go with. But if you're in the Las Vegas area, tap in with me. Let's see what we can do to start getting some of these uh, crypto parties together. If you have, uh, you know, I know a couple people with locations, you know, but if you have some locations, some venues, some ideas, things like that, help me put this together. Let's see what we can do. So uh, also in this video, I want to uh, do a coin that just came across my radar. But I want to show you all, you know, also how to use your indicators so you know when to buy into these projects so a lot of y'all ask me for uh buy and sell signals y'all know i got my private discord where i you know show y'all which plays i'm uh looking at and a lot of people ask for the buy and sell signals i, I don't like to do that because you know it, it, it's very risky but i'm going to show y'all a piece of my process on what i'm using you know or eventually throughout these videos i'll break down my entire process and show y'all what i'm doing to know when you know to buy these projects so let's do this review real quick see what we got with this one and just stay tuned, man. We got a lot of NFTs vid NFT videos coming up. I got to get my coffee, man. Shout out to the Sheeb Army. But we have Romeo Doge token, world's first multi-rewards token. Our smart technology studies the market, trend, and rewards its holders with a different cryptocurrency that has potential of fast growth on every reflection. Rewards include... Bitcoin, Ethereum, Binance, Alice Token, Zilka, Chainlink, Litecoin, Basic Attention, Cardano, Polygon, Polkadot, Bakery Token, Uniswap, Ethereum Classic, Ripple, Dogecoin, PancakeSwap, Tron, Coin98, Alien Worlds, BitTurrent, and 1inch. So the slippage on this one is 20%. It's high. Uh, I also put up their social media you know uh pages here just to you know so we can take a look into those to see what type of community they have around it so uh let's look at you know the tokenomics the roadmap let's see the team behind the project also i have the chart pulled up so we can actually you know look at the chart and do a breakdown because a lot of these projects if you get in early enough on a big enough dip if you know how to buy the dip and you know you know you can use your indicators to line that up and tell you you know you can basically get signals or uh, indicators on when to buy then you'll have a better chance at becoming profitable in these projects so I want to show you all that so treating holders with happiness multiple rewards in your wallet Romeo Doge is cute also he is very intelligent Romeo Doge is a deflationary coin designed to become more scarce over time all holders of Romeo Doge will earn more cryptocurrencies that are automatically sent to your wallet by simply holding Romeo Doge tokens in your wallet. So I like that feature right there. I'm not sure how they calculate, you know, which token they'll choose for today. Hopefully we can find that out. If y'all know, jump in the comment section. Let me know. Also, if you have a video you want me to check out, let me know. And do not forget in the description section of this video, there's almost, you know, thousands of dollars like in free stocks. If you get lucky enough to get that through Webull, uh, free crypto from coinbase uh, and a lot of other sites that i highly recommend that i'm using personally so check those links out in the description section also almost forgot y'all we got our book of the day the science of success how to attract prosperity and create harmonic wealth through proven principles by james arthur ray so check this book out it's on amazon right now it's a dope book also if you want to develop a solid investing foundation check out my book it's on amazon right now the link to that is in the description section as well so let's see uh multi rewards 10 percent of all transactions are stored in our smart smart contract this bnb cannot be accessed nor withdrawn by anyone this contract will buy multiple tokens i like that 
buybacks. 3% of each transaction is stored in our smart contract. This BNB cannot be accessed nor withdrawn by anyone. When the buyback feature is enabled, the contract will buy Romeo Doge from the circulation supply. So lock liquidity, majority of the LP tokens locked and some burned. So about Romeo Doge, stealing crypto lovers' hearts. Romeo Doge, the love of all crypto lovers. Romeo Doge is very giving and is designed to reward long-term holders. Community is first and foremost. Romeo Doge is proud to run with his father and provide transparency and fairness to the compu to the community. Our tokenomics. So this is uh you know the roadmap and the tokenomics are a very big part for me. Also, I like to see you know that if they have the team uh, doxed as well. So Romeo Doge, the love of all crypto lovers. Romeo Doge is giving designs. Okay, we read that part already. So 10% of each transaction is redistributed as rewards. 3% of each transaction is added to liquidity. So uh, our rewards, rewards, these dynamic cryptos will be sent to all Romeo Doge holders. So this is just, you know, uh, logos of the different tokens that are available. No rewards are subject to change in future as per community feedback. So as seen in these different uh, news publications. So phase one, I believe here's the roadmap. Paul board note check mark does not mean completed or not completed. So that was confusing right there. It says note check mark does not mean completed or not completed. OK, so I guess it's just listing it on the roadmap. So. They're just letting you know. I like how they have this clickable that we can, you know, flip through the roadmap like that. I, I like that a lot. So let's check out phase one attraction marketing push to spread awareness. Website launch 5000 Telegram members meme development. Romeo Doge is born. So that's phase one. One thing I like to see with the roadmaps, like I always tell y'all, the uh, crypto marketing goals should be three things. Specific, measurable and realistic. Right here, we can't measure this. This doesn't have a time. You know, it doesn't say, uh, you know, third quarter 2021 or fourth quarter 2021 or, you know, even September 2021. I would like to see some type of time attached to this so we can, you know, uh, basically hold them accountable for these certain goals or just have you know an idea of how long or how far out some of these goals are so uh i like that they got the meme development in there romeo doge is born i you know we can't even really put this in you know uh context of what happened and what hasn't because you know this part here it doesn't mean it's complete or not completed so i would like to see some more clarification on that so phase two dating Okay, I like how they have the phases labeled as, you know, attraction right here, phase two dating. So influencer marketing push, listing on CoinGecko, listing on CoinMarketCap, 25,000 Telegram members, 25,000 holders, third party audit. Also phase three, infatuation, 100,000 holders, 100,000 Telegram members, airdrop number two, large influencer marketing push, listing on major exchanges, central exchanges more memes from community so uh this hundred thousand holder goal is very ambitious you know a hundred thousand in a telegram very ambitious you know there's only a few projects that you know reach that level so the fact that they're saying they want to go that high you know that could be a good sign it's still you know very early to tell phase four love 150,000 holders increase marketing romeo doe swap and or add way more memes website redesign Romeo Doge Paul. So I wonder how far away realistically they have this because a website redesign should be, you know, in the near future. It shouldn't be, you know, pushed out to phase four unless this is all going to be happening. If, like, you know, this is by the week or, you know, something like that. But if this is one month, two months, three months, four months out, then, you know, or even three months or two months out, maybe two months okay, but it shouldn't be more than three months out for a website redesign, you know. So, um, that part should be sped up you know the things that can be done now should be sped up you know because like right now somebody like me makes a video on this a lot of people will see this video and you want to have everything you know all the small things like a website redesign get that out the way do that asap so uh romeo doge paul paul wallet growth tracker okay three hundred thousand holders release nft marketplace for romeo doge treats i like this right here so a lot of y'all know the nfts are becoming you know a very big market right now so this is the next wave that's why we're you know i try to tell y'all we will be not only covering stocks crypto real estate you know um business entrepreneurship but also you know these other investment vehicles and opportunities you know to be able to get in early and you know potentially make money if y'all have been following my plays if y'all have been in my private discord you know we've been killing it knocking it out the park with plays i'm about to turn it up about five or ten notches in there so make sure if you haven't joined my private discord you get at me to join that so uh 
My Facebook group is free to join Private Stock Market Game. I have about 1,000 members in a waiting room right there. That uh, community is at about over 4,000 members right now. I will be letting people in again soon. Make sure you answer the questions the correct way, you know, so you can get in. Uh, be looking out for, uh, you know, that to open up. Also, if you want pay access to my Discord, if you can't get into the, uh, you know, the group, then join me on Discord. Just email me for that or jump in the comment sections if you're serious. So uh, 250,000 donation to charity of community. That's a big donation. So they, they obviously, you know, are, you know, assuming that they will be very large in the crypto space. They also said give away Tesla to promote campaign of Romeo Doge versus Doge at $250 million market cap. So uh, phase five stability memes will be everywhere. They'll do that $250,000 donation to charity of community choice at a half a million dollar market cap and a half a million dollar donation to animal shelters when Romeo Doge is at a $1 billion market cap. So they're very ambitious. You know, they're saying, you know, they want to be able to give away a half a million dollars, you know, uh, at a billion dollar market cap. Not too many projects reach that. But y'all know, I say if it's a legit project and it really has like, you know, some utility behind it, then we can see, you know, anything under a billion dollars is cheap. So uh, they expect to have 300,000 holders in this phase. Really, I would like to see some more utility from this project. It says to release NFT marketplace for Romeo Doe's treats. Romeo Doe's treats will be available to Romeo Doe's holders. So I like that, you know, in the charity aspect, but I would like to see a little bit more utility tied into it. So phase six commitment. Donate to help build animal sanctuary at 50 billion market cap. 100 billion market cap community gathers to carve a Romeo Doge into a large mountain forever being locked as literally the largest meme in history. That would be dope. Now, that's, you know, that's a long way from something like that happening. You know, so uh, I would like to, you know, somebody from the team to chop it up with me. Let me know y'all plan to get to this point if this is, you know, something that y'all really see in y'all sites. But if that was to happen, that would be very dope. So at a $500 billion market cap, we form a Romeo Doge meme religion community will decide what happens. So, the, oh, a Romeo Doge meme religion in the community will decide what happens. So this is very ambitious to be, you know, saying $500 billion out. Uh, IT cap world's largest Romeo Doge meetup gathering. So for y'all that get in this project, y'all got to know to do, you know, do your own due diligence. Always, you know, do your own research. Never risk more than you're willing to lose. Understand that this is, you know, very ambitious to say 500 billion. You know, we only have, you know, a couple projects, you know, that a, a, a couple of cryptos that have reached this level. So know that this is a long way away. And I would like to see more of a solid plan on getting to that. But let's take a look at, um, uh, you know, do they have a team so that they don't have the team? Y'all know I, I always prefer the projects to have the team listed where we can know, you know, uh, who can we hold accountable for this project. But let's take a look at, matter of fact, let's take a look at the Twitter real quick before we go to the chart. So the Twitter is at Romeo Doge, 2,929 followers right now. Uh, so it's to the moon. Look like they got, you know, a couple people liking the post. Not too many. Y'all definitely want to pick up this social media. If y'all are a part of the Romeo Doge army and y'all are involved in this project, y'all need to get more awareness out, you know, as investors, as the team, whatever. Y'all definitely need to pick up the marketing to get more people aware of, you know, what's going on. So uh, it's nice that they got the coin market cap listing. That's dope. Okay, like to see that they got the Watcher Guru partnership. So they're, you know, they're doing what they're supposed to do. You know, they're they're trying to, you know, lay the foundation down, which is, I can appreciate that. But I would like to see the team behind this project. If y'all know who's involved with this project, let me know. I haven't had a chance to talk to the team on this one yet. Launched yesterday and slowly climbing. Okay. Okay, let's take a look at the Instagram. So Romeo Doge, Romeo Doge. So I like that they have, you know, some flyer type style pictures, what I'm seeing, you know, right away uh, announcing different things. So we are live. Hold Romeo Doge and earn 21 cryptocurrencies. Presale sold out in three minutes. All set to launch. Next destination moon. Trading starts at PancakeSwap. Uh, Romeo Doge, 6,500 Telegram members, 4,000 plus giveaway participants, 1,000 presale participants. 
So I like to see they already have a community in place, you know, that foundation to build off of. That's a, a strong sign. But I would y'all need to get this Instagram, you know, going a lot more. Six posts, this is unacceptable. You know, the, y'all need to talk to the team, let them know, you know, they they got to turn it up. I'm a, a Fortune 500 marketer, so I know a lot of things that are, you know, expect that people expect to see. And you want when people come to this, you know, you want them to see that, you know, y'all are working really hard to bring a lot of things, you know, uh, to the project. So we need to see more memes type content because y'all know right now memes slash NFTs are like the new currency. We need to see more of that style than just, you know, these flyers. So maybe do some community, get, uh, you know, contests, uh, you know, do some airdrops maybe to the best meme creators or, you know, even do a cash giveaway, something. But now let's take a look at uh, they got the Facebook as well. I like to see they're active over multiple social media platforms. So it shows potential. It, you know, it shows that they're trying to really, you know, be out here. You want to be everywhere that potential investors are. So uh, we are live. You got a uh, nice, nice, nice size community on Facebook. Make sure y'all uh, go join my private investment community, private stock market game here on Facebook. You would not regret it if you get in there. I'm telling you, we got people making over six figures in that group. It's, it's crazy. So uh, let's go check out the chart right now. So you see we had a nice run up here. Impulse correction impulse correction i like to try to make keep this as simple as possible and not like all these books behind me you know they they make it you know very complex to understand but you know i try to make this pointed out you know very simple for those beginners because mostly it's, it's people from you know intermediate to beginner levels a couple advanced people that you know tap in with the channel as well but it's a lot of new people getting into you know these spaces and i want to make sure y'all know how to you know uh have the best advantages so what i'm looking at right here is the chart for romeo doge one thing we're looking at is the locked liquidity we can see they have 291 million uh i mean 291,000 in there right now 1.4 million dollar market cap circulation 100 trillion it looks like let me see or 100 100 billion circulating supply so that's you know in that range that i'm okay with seeing but right now what we seen here was this is called an impulse a nice nice healthy run up boom or a nice strong run up then we got a nice healthy pullback right here you know gave people a chance to add to their positions boom a nice little impulse then we had a, a a nice pullback again to find you know uh just a nice support area in which why i would have believed this was a good support is because if you look a little ahead of the chart right here we can see it, it gave us another sign that this would be a support so when we had this run up right here look where it pulled back to this is i'm trying to keep it in, in simple terms just look where it pulled back to right here you know of course after we seen this once we seen this mass sell-off we could have seen, you know, we could have waited a few seconds. Like, is this the bottom? You know, a couple minutes. Is this the bottom? It, you know, it's dipping immediately. So we wait a few minutes. We see, you know, it's trading sideways. You could have, you know, got ready to enter your position. You would have waited a couple minutes. You would have seen it drop again. And then, you know, you would have been able to, uh, you know, load up right here. But let's take a look on a better chart, actually. I, I honestly thought we were just on the 15-minute chart right there. So here on the 15-minute chart, this is a, a better chart I like to look at. So here you can see that same impulse we had, the correction. The green part, when it shoots up, that's called an impulse. You know, there's people buying in, showing a lot of people excited about, you know, uh, what's happening right now. But then we had the sell-off. So here's the sell-off here. Here's a, a, a nice bottom. So here we don't have that same indication. So what we would have did to determine if this was a bottom is to use our indicator. So you want to come here on PooCoin. A few I like to use. One of my favorites is the Bollinger Band. Also, I like to use RSI, Relative Strength Index. So let's get the volume in there. You know, just a couple of them. And then uh, also a MACD. So if you take a look here, we've seen... Uh, it's here on the fourth. Okay, right here. So at this line, this dotted line is starting off at the fourth on midnight. So starting from midnight, we had a nice solid run up. If y'all would have been, you know, entered into this project yesterday, 
you know, you be up nicely right now. But we had a nice, you know, push after midnight leak going all the way up to about 2 a.m. So a nice run up for two hours. We had a pullback here for about another two hours. So y'all got to pay attention to that as well. You notice how long did it run up? It ran up for two hours, pulled back for two hours. That's just something to keep in mind. So uh, now we see we had another little run up for almost another two hours. No, this is about three hours here. But what I'm looking for is you see this top line here. This is called a Bollinger, the top Bollinger Band. This lower one is called the lower Bollinger Band. So what I'm looking for is I'm waiting for an entry point. You know, you don't always just have to jump in at any time. You want to wait for the chart to give you what you need to trade. So here's a nice run up. What we know, once the price hits this top Bollinger Band, there's, there's normally a sell-off because this means the price becomes expensive. Once the price becomes expensive, people begin to sell it off. So as it starts to sell off, we would have watched it sell, sell, sell on this 15-minute chart. We would have let it continue to sell off. And now what I would have been waiting for is for it to hit this lower Bollinger Band. You see it hit right here, but it continued to sell off. So I... but big red candles so remember the size of the candles matter the size is the confidence or the fear that people have so with the with the red candles being this big you know compared to the previous ones this shows us people are were you know uh, they were panicking so there was a big panic we let that panic run out we, we watch for the panic to you know to fade out so we got it on a 15 minute chart we can see it rolled along this lower bollinger band here then we see once the candles start get turning doji doji candles signal a reversal is likely to happen it doesn't mean it's exactly going to happen but it signals a reverse is a reversal is likely to happen so this is a doji candle right here you see we got the first doji signal it's like hey this this trend might be ending then we got another little sell-off then we got two more doji candles then look what happened we start getting red candles right after that so remember these little doji candles these crosses like this these are your early signals that the trend can begin to go the opposite way so then we had a nice green candle then we had this one here so i would have liked what i like to see is once the trend ends the downtrend ends we get those doji showing us you know we get the green candle coming in i would have waited for the next green candle to close so what we would have seen this 15 minute candle you could have entered anywhere on this position because you see the volume was strong here as well and we were extremely oversold so you could have really you know also combined this panic sale with this lower bowling with trading on the lower bollinger band which signifies the price is cheap for this price combined with doji candles signaling that a reversal is near combined with our relative strength index telling us that the price is completely oversold over here that's a strong buying signal now what you could have did waited for this moment here you know once the macd crosses the signal line you know that's also another sign to uh you know go long but here it would have been enough for me because i know this was a low point i know no matter what at here at this point this is a solid support area yes it could have pulled back a little further but i know most likely at it being this much oversold that you know it ain't gonna drop down to a one it ain't gonna drop down to a five so if y'all don't know what this means the relative strength index if it you know when it, you see how this line moves up to a price like this and it goes above this little dotted line right here this dash line that means the price i mean that means this this uh token is overbought once it becomes overbought we know pretty soon it will start to sell off so once the sell-off happens you know the price this this line will start to move down a 35 and under is oversold a 70 and above is overbought so we can see here right at this point we can see we hit a 74 it became oversold once it became oversold people start to sell it off panic 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 then look i mean my bad my bad not oversold right here y'all i meant overbought overbought is at the top so once it became overbought and overbought and hit this uh hit this uh over 70 this over 70 mark people start to sell it and once they start to sell it people started to panic and you see the candles get bigger and bigger as the panic sets in and then once it reaches a bottom area you know once it starts to reach an oversold area just meaning people are selling it too much too much the price is becoming too cheap for the value of it buyers and investors will step back in and buy it up and that's exactly what happened here so that's what you want to start to you know be able to do and line up 
you know, uh, your entry points. So I'm going to do this. I'm going to break this down over a few different tokens that I'm doing, you know, so y'all can learn this. Because remember, I told y'all this is a crypto class. It's not just a short crypto video where you just, you know, come, uh, you know, see what's up. You want to definitely learn, you know, what I'm trying to show y'all. If you want to become a future millionaire, this is, you know, this is the route. You know, I, let me show y'all. You see this? This is this week. This is the, this is this week what I'm tapping into. You know what I'm saying? So I keep these ones close, but this is a lot of the knowledge that goes into this video. So I'm trying to just uh, you know make it a lot shorter for y'all. So this you know 15, 20 minutes that you might have to trade for this video is always gonna be worth it. So make sure you share this video, tag me on Twitter. Uh, you get a chance to win something. Let's see what else we got. What's another sign we could have used? I, I like to use a few other indicators, but I don't want to overwhelm y'all. So right now, also, we'll take a look at the volume right now. So with the volume tapering off like this, look look at this where this major spike happened. This is where the volume came in and, and, and just shot it up. So you have to pay attention to the volume. The volume is always an early warning sign of, you know, is it dying down or is it picking up? So I always like to pay attention to volume as well. So here you see the as the volume tapers off, we begin to trade sideways. So what's going to happen is until either the volume picks up, some new news comes in, some type of catalyst or something, you know, it'll continue to trade sideways and it could even start to dip down. So if you're watching this video right now and, you know, uh, depending on what the chart's looking like, I would try to enter as close as I can to this point here at the lower Bollinger Band or when we see it begin to become oversold again. Now, it could have a, you know, a fake bear trap where, it, you know, it pushes up to, you know, bring people in and then another sell off again and hit this bottom Bollinger Band and then, you know, begin to take off to a new uh, high. But if you do end up getting in here and let's say or here at this point, let's say it does pull back down to here. Don't just panic and sell off your position because what that's what it's, it's wanting people to do. It might, you know, it might kick up right here to get a, a few new people in and then pull back down. If it does that, don't panic. You know, if remember, this is not financial advice. Always do your own due diligence, you know, whatever. This is just financial, you know, entertainment, education, whatever you want to call it. But what the smart thing would be to wait to it, you know, gets to this new support. And then load up on your position. That way, once it returns to this point, you know, back to a midpoint, you're basically breaking back even without it having to go to a new high. So uh, keep that in mind. Buy the dip. So uh, that's it for this video, y'all. I think this should be uh, very helpful. Let me know in the comment section if this video was helpful. Also, comment hashtag all the way through if you watch this video all the way through. Don't forget to check out the merch store. You know, if you're part of the Sheep Army, we got the uh, Shiba Inu coffee mugs, the hoodies, the T-shirts, the hats. We got everything. Y'all know I got everything in the store. Uh, the duffel bags. It's high quality merch, man. I highly recommend y'all to check it out. If you need help, uh, a lot of people reach out to me, you know. And I wish I could help each person one on one, but unfortunately, I don't have the time to do that. So I created a course. My course is available now. If you want to learn how to trade crypto, get my crypto course right now. It's going to turn you up. I'm talking about 100 notches. You know what I'm saying? So it's, it's a lot better than starting off and bumping your head the whole way through, you know, just to get straight to the point. Learn what you're doing. Learn how to start making money and, you know, become a, a better investor. So, uh, again, I'm December DeMarco. Appreciate everybody for pulling up. If you're new to the channel, do not forget on your way out to hit that thumbs up, like button, subscribe, turn on notifications, share this video, tag me on Twitter for your chance to win a free gift. Also, if you are OG to the channel, man, I got something special coming up for y'all. So, uh, you know, stay tuned for that. Also, I'm building my exclusive NFT holders list. If you want access you know, early access to my NFTs that I'm about to drop. Make sure you email me at DecemberDemarco at gmail.com. That's going to be big. And don't forget, if you are in the Vegas area, tap in with me. We're going to be doing these crypto parties. If you want to be involved in the, uh, you know, the setup, helping me get everything together, you know, uh, email me at DecemberDemarco. So follow me at DecemberDemarco on Twitter, Instagram. Y'all know we everywhere with it, man. Uh, that's all we got for this video, and we are out.